You've always dreamed of a home where all the places you want to be and the things you want to see are within reach. Where restaurants, shopping, entertainment, places of worship and quality educational institutions are almost a stone's throw away. And yet, if you choose to, you can live sequestered from the hustle and bustle of it all in a space designed for modern living and convenience. Now, realize your dream at Ruthven Towers. Conveniently located on Ruthven Road, near the central business district of New Kingston, this multi-story housing complex is being constructed in two phases. Phase one. Here, convenience and modernity are paramount, hence the gated entranceway and ample underground parking. The ground floor with meeting rooms is your bridge between private and public spaces. Ruthven Towers offers a choice of spacious one bed, one bath or two bed, two bath apartments, each with open concept kitchen, living and dining areas for ease of movement and a sense of space. Apartments feature seamless countertops and modern cabinetry. On upper floors, tempered glass doors glide to a bird's eye view of the city, while lower floor patios present lush vegetation on common areas. In phase two, the NHT will introduce additional apartments, select shops, a swimming pool, tennis and multi-purpose courts, and a gym making Ruthven Towers the complete living experience. For more information, visit www.nht.gov.jm. Ruthven Towers, for modern living and convenience. All right, guys, today you have a virtual tour of Ruthven Towers, which will be done by the National Housing Trust. And now we just have a little information about the Rookman Tours. Um, the one bedroom price is starting at $27.7 million. The two bedroom is starting at $35 million. The NHT is offering up to $15 million um, at 4%. 4% is the maximum interest rate that can be given. Um, you can have zero percent as well um if you're in a public sector you'll get a one percent reduction so for example if the four percent which is the highest band if you're in the public sector you will get three percent of that amount um the remaining amount the nhd is saying that that can be financed by them at an interest rate of seven percent or you might be interested and go to a financial institution. I know some financial institution now are offering like 6.65%. The only thing is that more than likely if NHC is financing all of the money, you might not have a heavy closing cost or processing fee. The closing cost they say is 5% of the amount that will be well, 5% of the unit is the closing cost. You know, the closing cost normally I think is the consideration escalation, um, processing fees, um, surveyor reports. You know, when you have to um, also set up lighting infrastructure, um, lighting documentation um, for water and those necessary things. So the closing cost will cover that amount. Um, the build currently what is completed is phase one. So tower one of the building is completed and um, phase two will see two, three and four towers. Um, when I did a rough check of, for example, you taking the 27.7 million property at the 4% interest rate for the 15 million and the remainder at 7% from NHT, you're looking at around, well, for a person who will be getting the full 40 years repayment, the payment will be around 140 per month, which don't include 
um, peril insurance and life insurance. So you just have to keep that in mind. So if this is a property that you're interested in, the NHT site will be available for the information and the application for the units. And you can go on the NHT site, visit it to get, get the application. I'm not sure if they're going to use a point system or they're just going to go for it and use affordability. If, if based on what I'm seeing with the 4%, it seems that like they'll be going for the affordability because someone in a lower income band, such as the 1% to maybe 0%, might have a little problem getting um, this amount as a loan from the NHT. So I guess this is more catering to persons in the upper band limit of the NHT, which is around, they said, 40,000 per week. So roughly you're looking at about a 160, 180 per month income. So that is the ban I think that they will be going towards. But it is not announced if they will be using a point system or they will be just using, using the affordability of the units. I know a lot of persons will be um, saying the prices is not low income houses, but boy, that is another debate with the NHT. Um, but if you're interested in this property, visit the NHT website and look for more information there. And also you're able to maybe apply to it when the application is open. So thank you for watching. And I hope this information was um, important and you find, found it informative. So remember to like, share and subscribe to the YouTube channel. Thank you.